we've come to the second part of our big data session. Uh, the objective is basically very simple. It's to understand the in information that will be needed to operate a business or a business process. We'll talk about a business process. What is a business process? I'll sh show an example of a business process. I'll show how the process and information flows in a business process. So what is the emergence of big data? How businesses will use big data and analytics? and how a big data can be made simple. A business process is a set of structured related activities and tasks. Let's assume that there's a purchase department in a company and it's going to buy some equipment or item or service or whatever from a service provider or a product provider. What will it do? It will raise a purchase order or create a purchase order. The purchase order is then sent to the finance department. It approves the budget. It goes back to the purchase department saying that your request for purchasing this equipment, what the purchase order then does to release the purchase order to the vendor. What does the vendor then do? He collects them all in a, in a, in a package and you receive the goods. The constituents are very simple. There has to be vision, people, the decision making uh, ability, data. There's a process of improvement that needs the process and information flow. Look at the cons look at the players in this in this diagram. You have a HR department, you have an IT department. It's the data which constitutes what what is said as as a feedback. That's what flows. Emergence of big data in the context of uh, business processes. We're starting off with megabytes, and look at the top. We're talking at about petabytes now, because uh, other than volume, velocity, and variety, let's look at what's triggering them all off. Transactions are triggering them off. Interactions are triggering them off, and observations are triggering them off.